Okay, I never got to go out when I wanted. I ate at Subway and got food poisoning or salmonella poisoning. I don't know. I got something. I was down for three or four days. And I was working on a client. But I plan to go out tomorrow. And boy, it's cold. We're sitting 32, um, 27. We are cold. It's going to be an interesting trip. I'm going with that camera, the Osmo one, with that selfie stick and that tripod all pieced together so I can do just about whatever I want. Um, a battery to charge the Osmo, and it's got two extra batteries there in case I need them. A light and its filters. I'm not sure if I'm going to use the filters or not, but I'm going to bring them. They're not that heavy. Headlamp. I'm going to come down to my compass, uh, my folding saw, my pots. Um, up from there, I got a grill. Um, up from there, my water purifier. And that's actually going to go in the foot of my quilt when nighttime comes so it does not freeze or I will damage it. Coming down to my clothes, I've got long johns. Top and bottom is my first layer. That's for sleeping in. I do not wear that in. Um, puffy jacket. Again, I do not wear that in. That goes underneath me. And the brown bag has my quilt. The coat weighs about two pounds. So if I'm wearing the coat in, then and out, then it's okay. But if I got to put it in the bag, I'm going to add a couple pounds to the bag and that's going to suck. Now I come over here and, uh, I have a medical kit there, and then I have a fire kit, and I made them up. I had to look at my fire kit because I was missing some things. I got fat wood in there. I got cotton balls, wooden matches. I carry fire right on my side. Um, there, there's quite a few ways to light a fire there. In my medical kit, a lot of different ointments. A lot of it's for my dog. Uh, Benadryl in case she gets bit by a snake. And uh, because when a dog gets bit by a snake, usually it's on the snout and then uh, their throat uh, swells up and they die of suffocation, basically. They can't breathe. So in Benadryl, you just start feeding it to her and they keep that throat from swelling. And if that happens, I could be back there for a couple of days. Of course, TP, shovel, um, vitamin pills. Um, my shaker bottle for shaking up my juices, tent, tent pegs, and then of course we've got my lantern, two pads, one's a winter pad for me, the bigger one, the uh, shorter one is a summer pad, but I have a thermal rest that's going to go underneath that for Luna, and we, of course we have my two-man tent that me and Luna sleep in, just under two pounds, my chair, which is one pound, much smaller chair, and basically, that's all my gear without food. So, I'll put all this in, and uh, we'll see what it weighs. And I'll give you an idea what this weighs. Um, I will be taking tea. I need to get that and get my juices figured out first. And uh, what type of food I'm going to be taking. I'm definitely taking a steak. So... We'll have to see how this goes. Alright, let's see what this weighs. Alright, here's a few items I'm taking. Less the steak. The steak I had just before I leave. This is Mountain House and Chili Mac and Beef, which was sent to me from Tex Texan, which I'll be taking. With some uh, Sailor Box bread cookies, which I'm going to try. And chicken chicken fried rice in case I need it oatmeal hot chocolate um, lemonade raspberry to shake up those little packets there the silver thing is to stick the mountain house in okay you can make these yourself but it just helps it hydrate faster and it's extremely light and everything's going to go in that cuban fiber food bag in the top of my pack so that way i know where it is and uh 
I just pulled that Cuban fiber bag out and I tossed that on the ground and I'm pretty organized in them out there. Okay, let's see what this weighs. Okay, current pack weighs 34 pounds. That's complete with food. Um, no water, which sits on my waist. So basically, we're going to be carrying in 34 pounds. Camera sits in my hand. And uh, I was hoping to get it lighter. But I guess that's the best I'm going to do. All right, I'll catch you guys later.